I have a TV. I did it. Ah. It felt so good to do it too. So, current situation. I just took this down. Down, down. And put that. Because <laughs> oh, it looks good. Um, not just because it looks good, but come on now. Um, getting my life together right now. So, current situation. That's what she looks like. <laughs> that's what she looks like. Yeah, that's what she looks like. So this is how tall she is. Um, she is going to go over in that corner. Eventually when I get the bed moved. Yes, yeah, see my chaos. All of that. That's me right now. Um, I'm going to pause this. I'm going to open this box. Y'all should see how heavy this thing is. It's got to be like 100 pounds. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Um, it's heavy though, y'all. Like, it took me like a couple of trips to get this. Look at me. I got Kit Kat bar on my chin. My goodness. Kit Kat bar on my chin. Because it was bomblicious, right? Ugh. So it's by Marywood Industries. I, again, ladies, bargain shopper. That's the other thing I like about my channel is because I'm actually gonna do things where it's affordable, okay? For instance, like something like this. I actually, um, my neighbor, um, he gave it to me, but then he told me how he got everything because, you know, he, he was really sweet. And he bought, the flowers and everything at the Dollar Tree. And then he got the little vase at the Dollar Tree too. And he, it, it was two of them, but unfortunately during my move, the second one got broken. So I took the other two flowers and I literally just kind of stuck them in there and I put them above my sink and it kind of messed them up just a little bit. But I can actually show you really quickly. So, and it's just the sweetest little, cutest little thing. Um, I personally, I love stuff like this. I adore it because I'm the kind of girl who will kill a plant in five minutes. Literally, if you walk it through my front door, it's dead. Um, and it's not on purpose. It's just that I've never been a green thumb. My mother taught me what I know, but that's it. <laughs> it, it seems to not have retained any value. Um, and now Nika is barking at me. But yeah, this is just from the dollar store. You can find the cute little vases and then you just bend the flowers and stick them down in there. And then they're just like the cutest little decoration, which um, it works out for now because I am gonna be repainting the bed bathroom. I'm gonna be replacing this um, with a smaller, shorter cabinet that will actually fit in between the toilet and the sink. And once I get the pedestal sink, which is going to go here, I'm gonna take this faucet. I'm still gonna reuse the same faucet, um, but I am I, I'm gonna reuse the same faucet and I found a really pretty uh, pedestal sink which is actually going up against this wall here and then I'm gonna keep the same one. So it's gonna be little tiny, like minute changes throughout. Um, you guys will see certain things. Other things you'll see, like um, when I go to the malls, I like to window shop a lot and find things and, and see this little one here? She wants something. What do you want? Do you want your strawberry? Huh? Are you hungry? I have to get her some food. One second. Okay, so back to what I was saying. So, um, I, I like to bargain shop personally. This rack was only, I know it seems like a, a mint for some people, but this rack was $13 instead of uh, $20 um, at Target. And then there is also gonna be a shower caddy that I'm replacing currently right now, and my body gloves and stuff are up there. But currently right now I have just a little um, gross shower caddy that I moved in with. Um, which was never mine in the first place, but it's got all kinds of stuff on it, which, bleh, it's gross. Um, so that is my current situation right now. Um, these Ikea cabinets, I've had these for many, many years, um, but I love them to death because they have like super huge amount of space in them. And uh, I keep my books and everything in there. Yes, I have junk food. I am a junk food junkie. Okay, um, so 
I have like my books and things like that, my snacks, I have my, my year savings jar, um, my wine collection, water bottles, my tissue, all of that will be changed around, um, you know, eventually when I start really revamping everything, the bathroom is going to get painted and you know, just, you know, little big things here and there. And actually, it was amazing because I went into the laundry room to look for the drill, which I'm actually going to take back in there. And I found eggshell white, which should be plenty of paint to redo this bathroom um, possibly next weekend. We will see. So, little by little, we're getting things going. We'll see how that goes. Um, at the same time, while paying my bills. Okay, so I'm going to crack this box open and then I will get back to you guys in like a few minutes. Okay, I want to, I want y'all to see the cutthroat stuff that I actually go through in real life. Like I'm, I, I, I'm either weak or I just don't know what the heck I'm doing. Look at this. I can't get the box open. Like, it's like I have no hands. Like, no hands. Hold on one second. It's like I literally have no hands. I'm almost 30 years old. 29 years old and can't open a box. Uh, one side. Break my shoes trying to open a box. <laughs> By the way, this gesture was sixty five on Walmart.com. It came out to seventy four dollars after taxes. And so far, I'm already loving the color. Once I get the box open, you guys will be able to see it. So give me a second. I'll be back. Ah. Oh. Never mind. I won't be back. upside down. Correction, it's open the right side up. <coughs> Made it look upside down. <sighs> I have to locate all the instructions. what you get for bargain shopping. A wall mount. I think I might have to mount this to the wall. I'll find them, I'm sure. Ah. Almost there. Send me a button. 
What are you doing? Huh? Hi, Munchkin. What's up? See? That's what I get. That's what I get with a slow internet connection. A lagging Chromecast. Jesus be a fence. That's what I'm going to be dealing with the whole time anyway. It's not like I've never had to deal with it before. Okay. So I got a bag of screws, a couple of boards, and a lot of frustration on, I think, like six or seven pieces of paper. When I organize it, I'll find you guys, like, right back. Give me a minute. Yeah, want to know something funny? <laughs> Big piece of cardboard that I was looking for. Back panel. Big piece of cardboard. Wonderful. Glad I bought a drill and a hammer because this is really loud all of a sudden. I'm sorry. Okay. So current situation, that is the outside of the dresser. All of those pieces right there, that complicated looking pile wonderfully complicated looking pile it's actually just pieces for the drawers and then those are like side and back panels figure it out now let me show you something that's my room literally i'm building it right there I'm really good at finagling in small spaces when there's space. We'll see how this goes. So, figure out the situation here. Just cutting pieces apart right now. Tally said, put down the phone. There you go, Tally. I put down the phone. So I almost you know, pinched my ankle open just now with these scissors. That would have sucked. Yeah. Current situation is... That one goes over here. For you. Three. No, this is two. This is three, and I need... Piece. I need number four. Okay. Ah! Four! Okay. So. Pretty much. I'm trying to act like a lady, but I'm thinking like a man. Because these actually only have instructions mostly in Spanish and some other Latin based language. That's okay. 
Lemons, ladies, <laughs> are becoming lemonade right now. It's amazing. Trill. Alrighty. See, when you pay good money for something, the screws come organized. When you pay a little less, they come like this. That's okay. Where are my scissors? You always end up with extra pieces, they say. I'm not trying to do that today. So I know I don't need the little nails right now. Those actually go in the back to keep that wood panel on there, which I kind of knew what I got myself into with this one. Ikea didn't come exactly the same way, but I was pretty doggone sure. So... Okay, so these go on the corners here. One here. So I can keep reference. Um, I'm gonna pause and I'm gonna come back because I only have maybe about a few more minutes of recording and I have to upload a video and delete a video in order for you guys to continue watching the torturous notions that I'm putting myself through. So, you will see the next video. Actually, no, I'll keep it going because at this point, if I only have a couple minutes going, I have 20 minutes and eight seconds worth of video that I can record. So I'm just gonna record the whole 20 minutes. If you wanna keep watching, keep watching and don't. I'm just trying to figure out this amazing maze and you'll see that even with you know what they call a cheapy freddy dresser it's just as good people just need to learn how to be a little more gentle with their items um i'm not a cheap individual i'm just the kind of individual who loves, doesn't like to spend money on something that is going to pretty much do the same job as the more expensive much heavier furniture so don't judge me at all. Alrighty. I know those definitely go in there. Most definitely. And it's the same on the other side. Okay. Um. Ah! Hello. Okay. So. Pretty much know that these are the ones. Let me see. Yep, that go into here. Drill. just enough where it won't damage anything and I'm getting to run out of time so you guys are gonna see me actually closing out this video drilling holes or drilling screws into the pre-made holes and there are pre-made holes I'll show you in the next video and we'll continue building a dresser Yay. see you guys in a bit say bye 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 Nika tell them bye bye <laughs> See you in a bit, guys. We'll be back. Oh, maybe not. I'm actually overtaking video, which is kind of awesome. Hopefully it'll load, but 